Hello, it is I, a human being, and we're back playing Sims Free Play. Damn! <laughs> to summarize what the new update is, it's basically um, the Sim Springs neighborhood things, which, um, um, yeah. I don't really have access to the update, so I can't really say anything about it, but there is new Sim heads which is exciting in its own right. So that's good. Um, but I do have some exciting news. You're just gonna hear that. There you go. No, it's gonna keep going. Okay, we're good. So basically, what are we doing? So as you see, I'm a bit short on money at the moment. I'm a bit short on money, and the reasoning for that is brilliant. Because we have finally unlocked it, guys. We finally unlocked it. We have finally done it. We can we finally done it. Fuck off. We finally done it. And it is the effing high school. Yes, people can now teenagers can now go and do their shit. There we go. Are you a teen? You go in. You're a teen. You go in. Lock your teen. You go in. Yes. We ha we. This is our first time having like high school students. Just like damn. I can't believe it's taken us this long. No, you actually need to talk to people. Where's your mother? Um, five hours. Sure. Actually, no. Probably even easier. Ah, five hours. We'll leave it to five hours. There we go. Goodies. We got cats. Yeah. We got furniture. We got hairs. In my opinion, the thick braided hair set is the bear of the two. That's my opinion. It's more worth your money as well, since it's two different hairstyles. I'm just saying. You... I think that was you two. Really? Really? In front of my house? In front of my house? How dare thee. You go to bed. Go to bed. Go to bed, child. Stop that! <laughs> I can just hear it in the background. No! Why Why are you doing this? What? You're talking about split sides. Oh, that's the funnies. You're trying to make each other laugh. That's the funnies. Oh, that's the funnies. I don't like the funnies. They make terrible sounds for background stuff. That just reminds me of The Sims' death of electrocution. Hang on, what? <laughs> a sim is already being added to the town. You must wait for them to finish before you add another. Wait, who who's getting a kid? I actually can't remember. Oh, wait, I know. I know who's getting a kid. Sorry, Raidens. Sorry, Yaimiku and Raiden. Uh, 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 um... No, no, not Pugsley. Not Pugsley. Where's Sally? Sally! Sally, my gorgeous girl. Fuck, you're not home. Leave, child. I think I gave you a child. I gave you a child! Okay! That made it sound like that I fucked Sk Sally. I did not fuck Sally. Let's make this clear. I did not. But hey, we have another child. I have to get my tablet out for this. Because I couldn't remember the character or its name. Ruby. No, 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 no. No, no, no. You're gonna be the palest shit. Um, Barrel. Barrel? Barrel. Um. So, I'm gonna explain this again. Um. Nightmare Before Christmas characters. Um, with. By the way, by the way, um, Jack Skeleton is dead in The Sims. He died of old age, yeah. So he's not in The Sims anymore, so it's just Sally and the kids. 
But yeah, Nightmare Before Christmas, kids, you know, it's the trickle-treers, basically. We're making the trickle-treers. He's a purple boy. He a purple boy. What do you think Barrel's personality is going to be like? He would be entertaining. I would say he's sort of like a geek and entertaining. Should we put him entertaining? And we give him a bronze orb. Because we can. Or do I go with sporty? Yeah. We already unlocked the geek thing. Um... Do We do not have purple. We have purple! It's fine. We have purple. Now, your hair here is green. I don't think we have green. But we have... But your hair is going to be short. So let's go with brown. Let's go with black, I mean. And you don't have an eye color. I'm looking at a picture of just, like, the trick-or-treaters. Just, like, staring into a camera. And it's really creepy. Their eyes are very unsettling. Like, what? It's just two B dots. Yeah, that's kind of unsettling. I don't know what his eye color should be. Should we make them black? Yeah, I think black is, like, the best way to go. Do we have any purple? No, we don't. That's really sad. Anyway, guys, this is the Barrel Skeleton, and welcome to the family, boy. Woo! Yeah. Out of, out of the three trick or treaters, I do prefer Shock more, but Barrel is my second favorite out of the three. I'm sorry, Lock, you're my least favorite. I'm sorry. Where's your mother? Where's your mother? I don't know where your mother is. Where's your mother? There you are. There you are. Let me. Let me. I don't care if you're going up the stairs. I want to use you. There you go. Uh, I want you to cuddle. I want there to be a connection. I want a connection. We don't really have uh, any Sims family like not get along with each other. Next gen. Next gen. Yeah. This is buzzing off. I don't care about Influence Island. It's like my least favorite thing in this game. Anyway, what I was gonna do... We're gonna go to the Ryder family. Because we also need a kid from them. We also need a kid from them. And you guys are probably wondering, what kid is that gonna be? Well... There is three Raidens. Actually, there isn't, but we're not talking about Honkai Impact. <laughs> so we have Raiden Shogun, Raiden A, and Yai Miku. We're, we're gonna get rid of Makoto. 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 I'm saying it wrong. I'm saying it so wrong. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I was yawning while talking. And I have made... Um, the decision, along with my friend who is further into Genshin Impact than me, that we can make Raiden Shogun the daughter of Raiden A and Yaimiko. And then we can have Scaramouche Wanderer bitch as the second youngest child. And then we can get the bad parent-child relationship. I mean... We need that in the game. Support ev we're supporting everything in this in this playthrough. <laughs> God dang it. Uh, so yeah, we need a baby here. We don't have enough money for a baby. Okay, that's fine. You guys can be romantic shits and I'm gonna I don't know what I'm gonna do. You guys need to work. Damn. Yeah, so Another thing we're going to have to talk about is Wednesday and Pugsley situation. I know that they're supposed to be of similar ages. I understand that completely. But they're in the same age group at the moment. And that is worrying me. And the thing is, I can't... I can't advance Wednesday, can I? I can't advance Wednesday because of her fucking life dream. 
which is irritating me because <laughs> why, why, why? Wednesday, 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 Wednesday. Play with a dog. I don't care how to play with a dog. Uh, Wednesday, can you play with your train set? Uh, Frankly, there's only two of them. I'm saying that there's only two of them when canonically there is a baby, but that depends. That depends on what you're calling canon at that point. So yeah. Uh yeah, we're just gonna leave you be. Ah We're also gonna need to do relationships at some point as well. Cause you, my lady, you fabulous looking lady. We need to work on you. I've basically just been leaving like a bunch of Sims by themselves. Like the OG children of Gen 3. I've just been leaving them. So next episode, we're gonna need to work with relationships. I have to think of the relationships, but we're gonna need to work with it. Sarada, do you have a dream? I want a dream of a zombie apocalypse every day. Good for you. Good for you. Let's go to Sarada so then she can dream about a zombie apocalypse. <laughs> I forgot that that's her dream. I forgot that's her life dream. Look at her. Ain't she cute? She's so cute. I love her. Yeah, I had to age up some characters to teens. That's why certain characters don't look as they are. Like, Locke has his- is going through his transformation phase. Context! When a Nightmare Before Christmas kid is a teen, they're going through a transformation age. Because, as you guys know, all the characters in Nightmare Before Christmas who live on the Halloween side are dead. So, I had to try and incorporate that. So, teenage years is their transition era, where they leave their childhoodness of being alive to their deadliness of being, well, dead tricksters. But yes, they are, they're, they're beautiful. We love them very much. So yes, you need to dream. How do I get this dream thing? Do I m put you to bed? Darling, I need you to go to bed. Dream of the zombie apocalypse. Will we get like special sort of like animations with this? Yeah. Yeah, we're at max capacity here. We're at max capacity. Uh, I want to see if there's any... Oh, any new animations. From what I can see, there is no extra animations with this. Oh, jeez. I hear the cat. I heard the cat. Where's the cat? I don't know where the cat is. <laughs> Where'd the cat go? I don't even know if they can get up. Oh, there you are. Hey, thank you, little buddy. Oh, Sasuke, you're here. I didn't even notice you were here, bubs. Can you feed the cat? <laughs> can you feed the cat? Just, just can you? Look, look at the cat. Look at poor. Look at that face, though. The cat's face. <laughs> it's so fucking stupid. I love it. Pet the cat for me, please. No. <laughs> He's so pretty. I have I all three of my cats are inside the house at the moment, and they're all asleep. So they would probably claw me if I tried to wake them up. So this is I'm living through this at the moment. Oh, he's so cute. Yeah. Anyways, everyone, that's it for this episode of the Sims Free Play. I hope you guys enjoy this episode, and yeah. Ooh. Leave a comment for any sort of like fandom or characters that you want to be added into the series. And yeah. Or if you got like certain ships that you've 
thought of about this series, then please tell me below. I may actually incorporate them. But yeah, for now, I hope you guys enjoy, and see you guys next time. Bye-bye!